On Monday, David Ortiz had his eyes checked. He received the all clear and a few eye drops. Tuesday hit his third home run of the season, and if Thursday is any indication, Visine may have a new pitch man. Brad Penny, we'll start with him, of course. As Brad Penny is on the mound tonight for Boston, he makes his 12th start of the year, comes in at 5 and 2 with a 5.85 earned run average. Inside ball one at 96. And they hit Alex Rodriguez. Second time they've come inside. This one hits him in the back. It's almost like with this at bat, they started him off with a fastball in that almost hit him. And they didn't really care if they hit him or not, I think, in this at bat. You see a 0 2 pitch that he was not going to leave out over the plate, not even close. Empires getting together after this hit batsman. And let's see which direction they go in now. I mean, they're well aware of, of what's going on. I mean, and they're not exactly keeping score like maybe we no. do. But you have to figure here, they're trying to interpret whether or not this was intentional or not and see if there's going to be warnings, and there are. A warning to both sides. And this will bring Terry Francona out. And they put four heads together and they said yes that had to be on purpose now whether or not it was we'll never know. Cano loops it to left Bay is there and the Red Sox left fielder puts it away. CC Sabathia here at Fenway Park for the first time in a Yankees uniform a five and three record. To right field on comes Nick Swisher. And he's there in plenty of time to make the catch. The Red Sox strand a pick. Strike three call. Needed that. First strikeout of the night. And Melky Cabrera is the victim. Very occasional split finger. Fly ball struck well to left. Back goes Bay. In front of the scoreboard to make the catch in deep left. And well off the bag at second is Swisher. They can make it two and they do. In left field by Bay, Swisher thrown out at second base. Ortiz opposite way to deep left and out of Fenway. David Ortiz has gone deep for the fourth time this year, and the Red Sox lead it one to nothing. Opposite field shot for Big Poppy. Is this another sign by David Ortiz? I mean, it has to be. You're talking about one of the best left-handers in the business, and he takes his cheese over the monster into the seats. I say that this says a lot about David. His timing's coming back. Swing and a miss. Nick Green strikes out. Foul tripped, held on to by Veritek for strike three. Second strikeout for Penny. See ya. On the corner for strike three. The skinny five foot ten guy's not going to make it. Drew strikes out, grabs the inside corner, and it's the second strikeout for CC Sabathia, two down. Yeah, especially when you're throwing 250 innings like he did last year. This strike three call. Sabathia's getting better as the night goes. And I love the way they told a story. Nick Swisher is down on strikes. It's a fourth strikeout for Brad Penny. And there's two down here in the fourth in conjunction with his great career. A 1 1, a 1 hopper gathered at second by Cano, picks himself up and throws out Jason Bay. Jason Bay hits this ball sharply, fastball away, stays on it, one hops Cano. Loses his balance, gets up, makes the play. It's a nice play by Cano right there. You see, uh, you know, infielders diving all over the joint. Really? So your odds are not good. Foul tipped, held onto by Cervelli. It's the fourth strikeout for Sabathia. Grounded to short. Jeter will flip to second for one on to first. It's a double play. With two outs here in the fifth inning. Yes. Strike three call. Petroya hates it. Want to keep rolling. Three two. Struck him out looking. Nice outing for Brad Penny.
There goes the runner at first, and it's lined into left field. A base hit for Cervelli. So Cabrera just keeps on going, and he's going to try and score. The cutoff from Green, the throw is high, and the game is tied. That happened fast here in the seventh inning. I think you kind of go to sleep here with Cervelli at the bat. You know, not really giving him enough respect. You, th you talk about throwing him a fastball. He leaves his fastball up, room service, up and in. He's yanking out of there. Hits a bullet down the line. Goes into the corner all the way to the wall. Bay plays it nicely, but there's no shot at the plate. High throw. Big double by Cervelli, and this game's tied like that. Rodriguez towards center field and deep. Baldelli back, and it is off the wall. Cervelli has scored. Damon's going to try and score from first base. Two runs in for New York. A-Rod has come up big for the Yankees. They take a 3-1 lead. A-Rod was so due in this series. He hadn't done anything up until this at bat. I'll tell you, he's worked a lot of counts. This count being another one, three and two. He tries to throw a fastball in, does not get it in there. And he strokes this ball. I'm surprised. I was thinking this ball might be out of here, but it hits the fence about halfway up. He scalded that ball, just didn't get it up in the air. But the way he goes about it doesn't show any emotion. Baldelli strikes out. Red Sox leave Ortiz at first. We played seven. It's three to one, New York. One two to Cabrera to center field Baldelli on the run dives makes the catch in left center Rocco Baldelli laying it out in left center field to make the grab for out number two and This ball kept slicing and slicing and slicing and he went into his dive and had enough to reach out and get this ball you see Cabrera hits this ball kind of slicing away from Baldelli and last second dive, he gets just enough to make the snatch. Full extension. Beautiful play by Baldelli. Green lines it to left field, a base hit to get the bottom of the eighth inning started. 111 for Sabathia. Dustin Pedroia is 0 for 3 as he takes strike one. They go up. Pedroia does not chase a ball and a strike. Outside ball two, two and one. Pedroia fouls it off and it's two and two. Pedroia fighting it off foul. Again the two, two. Pedroia again fouls it straight back. Pedroia rips this foul back into the seats. And that's what I mean about a little sloppy little breaking ball. That ball gets hit hard. Pedroia fouls off another to the right, and it hangs at two and two. Ball three. And he's up to about 120 pitch count now. This at bat has really cost him. Tenth pitch of the at bat for Dustin Pedroia. And it's ball four. He loses it. First two have reached for the Red Sox in the bottom of the eighth. And here comes Joe Girardi. Green at second. Pedroy at first. Drew. Back up the middle into center field. A base hit. Here comes Nick Green. And it's a one-run game. To right field and a base hit into right. Pedroia is being stopped late by Hale and he does get back to the bag at third. Base is loaded now and a drive to left. A liner in for a hit. Pedroia from third. The throw cut off. Game tied 3 3. In the air to shallow left center field. Gardner is under it. Makes the catch. Drew's going to try it. The throw is not going to be in time, and the Red Sox take the lead.
the ground, up the middle, Green spins and fires and gets Jeter! What a play by Green. Nick Green started the rally with a base hit in the eighth inning, and he starts out the kills the rally for the Yankees in the top of the ninth with a play up the middle. A little spin move. You see this chopper. Looks like it's got CNI chopper up the middle. He gets to it, spins all the way around, got something on it. Bang, bang, first play. Base hit, takes it away by Nick Green. Papelbon and Papelbon against Mark Teixeira. Share hits it squarely, but right at Kevin Euclid. Papelbon with his 16th save as the Sox sweep the three-game series and improve to 8-0 and against the Yankees in 2009. The Sox now with a two-game edge in the American League East. Takashi Saito earns the victory in relief. CC Sabathia takes the loss as he was responsible for all four runs in seven-plus innings. Sabathia drops to 5-4. and four.